morning, friends. We have another fun show ready for you, starting with a local women-owned restaurant in the Zionsville area, known for their flavorful and authentic Thai cuisine. And it smells so good in here. Plus, yeah. we'll tell you about an upcoming event that aims to make the fashion world more sustainable, led by a group of local business owners who really want to make a difference here in our community. And indie singer-songwriter Ryan Brewer joins us for a live performance, along with details about his upcoming show at Feinstein's. Indie Now, now starts, starts now. now. This is Indy Now. Hey, good morning. How are you? I'm good. How are you? Great. Good to see you, as always. Great to see you as well. Yeah. I like the floral accents. Thank you very much. I like the, uh, it looks like a leopard or jaguar, maybe. <laughs> I don't know which large cat print that it's, is. It's a large cat of some sort. Whatever it is, you're yeah. rocking it. Great well, job. You hear we're rocking some 50 Cent right now? Yeah, yeah. It's fitting, because mm -hmm. last night at the Pacers game, a sight I never thought that I would see. What's that? 50 Cent was pushing Will Ferrell. Uh -huh in like a mini IndyCar replica oh. out onto the court to kick off last night's Pacers game. Naturally. <laughs> 50 Cent and Will Ferrell. Did you ever think that you would see them together just doing something? No. I mean, yesterday, like, the, the newsroom was kind of a buzz just knowing that, like, oh, my gosh, Will Ferrell's, Will like, Ferrell's in town. filming a documentary in yeah. Peach Grove. You know, uh, 50 Cent was there, obviously, but uh, uh -huh. that's pretty cool. That's an interesting combo. It was really cool. Yeah. He went and grabbed the mic from B. Swift, who was emceeing with yeah. me, and yelled into the mic. It was like, let's go, Pacers fans. I love it. I felt like it was a scene from old school. <laughs> like, I was like, what is happening? This is amazing. Grab your green hat. <laughs> It was awesome. I Great to have movie. him here. Yeah. yeah, that's really cool. I hope he's enjoyed his time in, in Indy, in I the hope Circle so City. Too. Yeah, yeah, so fun. Today's show is going to be so much fun. Oh, it really is. It smells great in here. I am so excited. Yeah. And we cannot wait to show you all the good food and the guests we have. And we always like to start every show off on, on a good, good note. note. Yeah, we do. And you know we love a good giveaway. So we were telling you about this yesterday. We're doing it all week. We're giving you a chance to win tickets to the Flower and Patio Show. So for your chance to enter, all you have to do is email IndyNowGiveaway at box59.com right now. In the subject line, go ahead and put Flower and Patio Show, and good luck. Yeah, and if you don't win today, you will have other opportunities throughout the week to enter to win. It sounds like a really fun event, too. I mean, perfect timing for it. Oh, I know. When yeah. you think about refreshing the outdoors, getting ready yeah. for the spring season. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, look at that. Love it. So there you go. Indie Now giveaway at fox59.com. Uh, good luck. Yeah, let's go meet our first guest. Let's do it. Let's do it. I'm Come so on. excited about this because I have to admit, this is a place that I personally go and yeah. love. And so I'm so excited for our next guest. Oh, my gosh. We got an amazing uh, Thai restaurant in town. Welcome to Lala de Bisub. She's the owner and head chef of Thai Corner Restaurant restaurant and bar in Zionsville. Lalada, thank you so much for being Hi. here today. It's so good to be here. Yes. Oh my goodness, I'm so happy you're oh here. Oh my goodness, nice to meet you. Oh, nice this to meet you as well. looks and smells incredible. I love yeah, Thai it's food. Amazing. And I was really excited when Jill was like, just mm -hmm. wait until we get uh, Thai Corner in today. It's all authentic. So how do you yes. describe your restaurant? Um, our restaurant is um, we locally owned by two women right yes. in White Town and Sionsville community, and we have nice patio. Oh, the patio is great. We have food bar service, and uh, of course we serve authentic Thai. Oh my gosh, yes. it looks so good for someone who's never tried Thai food before. Uh -huh. What's maybe a good starter that you would recommend? I would recommend Pad Thai. Okay, Pad Thai yes. right over here. Pad Thai, okay. Pad Thai. I I probably heard people just zero percent that said like they don't like that. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Oh, it's, likes a good pad it's very good. Uh -huh. So that's a good starter right there, and you can get different protein on top, right? Yes. Yeah. Yes. What uh -huh. else did you bring with you here? Yeah, I know we have a over easy grab how. Is this like a kind of street food in okay. Thailand? Yeah. It's very popular. Yeah. You can find um at right um at the street. You know, okay. and um, we brought it up here, and everybody love it. Nice. And um, uh, the popular one is a uh, uh, crab fry, right? Okay. That we are different. We never been uh, like everyone. It's very authentic. Like when you eat, it's like um, you eat in Thailand. Yeah, yeah. Just like the Thai cuisine that you yeah. get uh -huh. there. And uh, that's why we brought um, the um, uh, raw duck curry. Okay. Oh, okay. Wow. Yes. And uh, this on special right now is um, crab, uh, sacha crab. 
with the chili, sweet chili, sweet chili sauce. Wow. It's very good. People love that too. Crab, duck, shrimp, soft shell mm -hmm. crab. Oh my and gosh. Is this like our appetizer <laughs> here and now we're very popular as well. Yeah. We have muping. This is um, uh, like a barbecue pork on school. Okay. And skewer and uh, with, uh, with the sauce. Yeah. And uh, it's a shrimp donut that I, I just roll like a donut and then and and fry that with the plum sauce and curry puff with the uh, potato and chicken stuff inside with the cucumber sauce and of course the popular one is a uh, tok beef. It's like a grilled beef. We use we use a top sirloin beef at our restaurant. Okay. You know, best quality so good. and uh that's another popular one is pork belly like everybody talk about it hmm? okay i feel like we gotta I get, gotta get uh -huh. into the sirloin oh the last the one soup over here yeah that's, that's your favorite, favorite. <laughs> which one is that the Chilean favorite mm -hmm. from yum mm -hmm. and another one is um the same with the soup uh, but we put coconut milk in there yeah, yeah. Mm. The oh, step room for dessert too. The sweet oh, sticky rice with coke, uh, with the mm -hmm. mango. Mm -hmm. Um, Flaleta, this is fantastic. The pork I knew, belly, this is so, so good. good. Yeah, I knew. and you have customers coming from all over the place. Your regulars are yes. driving an hour oh. away to come here. Yes, um, especially Thai student from Purdue. Yeah, oh, they, that's great. They they're like, oh, when they come at my restaurant and feel like home, mm. and yeah. they just you know well, like 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 piece of home. twelve years ago I. I just feel like I want to eat some Thai food that I feel like, yeah, it's a Thai. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It brings you back. Now, mm -hmm. you're going to show us how to make something over here? Exactly. This is um, this is a, another popular salad that you can eat for lunch, you can eat for dinner. Okay. And um, I think it's fun for like uh, the two that we have right now, yeah. you know? And we're going to start to do that, like we're going to put garlic, fresh Ooh. garlic. And how spicy do you like? I oh. like a little bit of spice. Yeah, I like some spice right? too. Okay, yeah, I'm, let's I'm get, adventurous. I don't know do if I'm like. Let's do two, okay? And we can add topics <coughs> like that. You All know right. what I tell her when I have the spiciness when I add it to the tom yum soup? Yeah. It was helping clear out my sinuses. Nice. I think it was helping me get better. Yeah. I'm just saying. <laughs> uh, what are we adding in next over here? Yes, yeah, a green bean and a tomato. Okay. Okay. Love it. And, and Lavada, what, what's the name of this salad that you're making? This, uh, we call papaya salad that we uh, shredded papaya, okay. you know, and uh, a little bit of the carrot. If you don't, if you couldn't find green papaya, you can do with uh, carrot as well. Okay. Cucumber, nice. that's yes. fine. Okay, and after that, I have the sauce. Oh, is yeah. this the secret, the secret sauce? Um, not very secret, <laughs> but uh, <laughs> you know fun. what? Um, the sauce is contained with fish sauce, but you know, we have a secret that make it the fish sauce is not smelled at all. Mm. Oh, nice, okay. okay. And the prom sugar. Ooh. I love that. What made you want to open up this restaurant? What is want, right? Um, I grew up watching my mother, yeah. my grandma uh, cooking, you know, and um, I love, I love to cook. Um, cooking is my passion, yeah. even under pressure. And um, <laughs> you know, when you cook in the restaurant, you cook under pressure. And um, yeah. yeah, so you yes. have to love it. You yeah, do. I, yeah. I, I have to love it. Yeah. I have to love it. And, and luckily, I love it. There you go. <laughs> well, you can really feel the love in everything that yes. you do. And I love that yes. it is Patch a local women owned restaurant. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's right there in Zionsville, right before you get to Whitestown on Whitestown Parkway. So it was something that I stumbled on and nice. I said, wait a second, yeah. this food is amazing. We have to get them on the show. Uh -huh. How is the salad coming along over here? Okay, oh, I think really you're good. gonna try. Oh, that looks that fantastic. Yeah, I'm stoked. Yeah. I love I love eating new food. And I love the color. Yeah, and it's healthy it's too. Bright. I mean, there's so many vegetables so in there. Um, yes. Lavada, I understand too that you have a promo for mm -hmm. Indie Now viewers, right? Yes, we do. We offer 20% from today until uh, this Sunday. Oh, thank okay. you. Okay, and That's I great. just, all you have to do is just mention Fox 59 Indie Now. Wonderful. Thank you for doing yes. that. 25% yes. off all week. If you mentioned that you saw this segment, thank yeah. you on Indie Now here on Fox 59. All right, you ready to try here this? Here we go, all right. Okay. I'm excited. Look, it's got the little, little peanuts on it too, yeah. right here. Mmm. That is so fresh. Is Ooh. it too spicy? There's no, the kick. So I know. Good. Thai pepper. There's the kick. I yes. love it. It's great though. It's uh -huh. absolutely oh, fantastic. I can mm. breathe better now. Whew.
Mm. That is instant, really good flavor. It's really good, and I, I do love the crunch of the peanuts on yeah. top here. You can add. That's you, great. You can add protein too, yes. like like a trim. Yeah. Oh, amazing. Oh, somebody add chicken, but yeah. I never eat it, but it's still good. Yeah, okay. <laughs> there you'll it is. add it if someone likes it. Right. Thank you so much for Thanks, coming. Thanks, Lavender. Very nice to meet you. Very nice to meet you. Go check them out in Zionsville, right off of White Sound Parkway. Thank you so much. Absolutely You're delicious. Welcome. Hey, coming up, we'll check in next with our friends from the City Moms, mm -hmm. who will walk us through their recommended survival kit for grandparents who are hosting their grandkiddos for a visit. That's right, and they have ideas for all different ages, and they're sharing the details when we come back. We'll see you soon.